And that's going to do it for us this time around. If you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to like, follow, and subscribe to the Disruptive Technologies Podcast. Stay connected to catch all the latest updates on cryptocurrency, AI, and other game-changing innovations. Thank you for listening to this episode of the Disruptive Technologies Podcast. We'll see you next time. The battle to make artificial intelligence accessible to everyone just got a big boost with the launch of Morpheus. Now, Morpheus is a decentralized AI network that's designed to tackle issues like centralization, censorship, and the monopolistic control over data. The Morpheus team officially kicked things off on Monday with an announcement on X. They're telling us they're ready to challenge the big tech giants that currently dominate the AI scene. And Morpheus isn't flying solo. It joins the ranks of other decentralized AI projects like BitTensor, DAIOS, and the Boltzmann Network. These initiatives are all about fighting back against the major corporations that have a tight grip on AI data and development. Recently, Morpheus became a member of the Decentralized AI Society. That's a trade group that's formed to push back against the control that big tech firms have over both the AI industry and its regulators. Built on the Lumerian code base, Morpheus runs on the Arbitrum blockchain, which is a layer two solution on top of Ethereum's network. The platform went into public testing back in July and introduces, quote, smart agents designed to revolutionize personal AI. These agents are meant to empower users much like personal computers and search engines did back in the past. They can execute smart contracts, integrate with Web3 wallets, and connect users to decentralized applications. The push for decentralized AI comes from the belief that the current centralized model is stifling innovation. Big, centralized entities dominate the field, limiting diverse voices and risking too much government or corporate influence. Morpheus is part of a growing movement to give power back to the individual. By providing tools that fit seamlessly into the Web3 ecosystem, Morpheus lets users have unprecedented control over how AI interacts with their data and applications. Even though Morpheus is still in its early stages, it marks a major move towards decentralizing AI development. The aim here is to reduce our reliance on tech giants, with a strong focus on user empowerment and blockchain integration that aligns with broader Web3 values. This shift hints at a changing balance of power in the digital world. However, there are hurdles to overcome, like achieving scalability and gaining widespread adoption. Morpheus isn't just another blockchain project. It's a bold statement. By decentralizing AI and teaming up with like-minded initiatives, Morpheus intends to challenge the dominance of centralized systems and pave the way for a fairer, more open digital future. Now, whether it can reach its ambitious goals will depend on its ability to scale and compete in an AI landscape that's still largely controlled by the established players. So Morpheus is a promising step forward in the quest to democratize artificial intelligence. Its decentralized approach seeks to empower users and reduce corporate dominance in the AI field. The success of Morpheus will hinge on overcoming its challenges and gaining traction in the competitive world of AI. And that's going to do it for us this time around. If you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to like, follow, and subscribe. Stay connected to catch all the latest updates on cryptocurrency, AI, and other game-changing innovations. Thank you for listening to this episode of the Disruptive Technologies Podcast. We'll see you next time.